Okay, for this interview, um, inimbitahan ko po yung aking former assistant. Hello po. Ah, former assistant. Tapos ito po, siya po isang beauty pageant aficionado. Talagang marami pong alam nito pagdating po sa pageants. Um, may I introduce to you, Alec Africa. Hello po, mga kapamilya and kapuso. Ay! <laughs> <laughs> Ganyan po talaga siya. Masaya siyang kasama palagi. That's why masaya yung aming samahan dati ni Alex. Yes. Kaya lang bigla na siyang, syempre, big career na rin. Banker po talaga siya. Yes. Banker. Uh, hindi pa ng ano ha? Yung ano ba'y palabas? <laughs> Who wants to be a millionaire ba yun? Million. O hindi siya dun banker. Banker po talaga siya ng bank. Yes. Uh, nagsimula po yan sa City Bank. Tapos lumap, lumipat sa ibang kumpanya. And then another bank. This time. Ay, hindi po City Bank. Uh, Ay, ano ba yung Standard Chartered. Standard Chartered pa na. Oo. Oh. Pero, pero banko po talaga ang kanya, ang kanyang career. Yes, uh, talagang malalaman mo integrity ng tao kasi tumatagal siya sa ganung industriya. Anyway, alak, hindi tayo mag-uusap tungkol doon sa trabaho mo sa banko. Kasi ang aking, ang aking interviews may uh, mostly about production, about pageants, okay. modeling, Ay, yung mga ganun. At yung gusto mo. Di ba? <laughs> yes. yung, al, sa deep, di po sa puso niya. Yun po talaga ang gusto niya. Uh, actually, kung, kung, dat, kung alam niyo po dati yung pangalan ng kanyang Twitter ba yun, Ford Beauty Queen yan. <laughs> <laughs> Nakasama na rin po yun sa Instagram ko po and sa threads. Of course, follow me on threads. Oh, threads. So, may threads yes. din ako. Inalabas ko sa threads to eh. Okay. Bro, okay. okay. Uh-huh. So, okay. Alec, ganito. Paano ka ba nagsimula? I mean, paano ba nagsimula yung pagkagusto mo at pagkainteres mo sa beauty pageants? Oh. It's three, uh, well, it springs back, way back 1984 pa. Uh, panahon yun yun na Tita Des. Ah, kasi yung panahon na yun? Talaga. Yes, I think I was three years old. Kasi oh. my mom, my mom kasi was so fascinated with beauty pageants. Every time nga na nagkakaroon na Miss Universe, madalas gabi yun. Oh. Uh, she would always watch it. I would always watch it at her. I was always fascinated with costumes, with the countries. And I think tawag dito, from then on, sinubaybayan ko na sinubaybayan siya every, every year. Actually, we love Miss Universe. There was a time nga na nagkaroon ng Miss World, Miss International. Pero natutuwa ako sa'yo, naluloka ako sa'yo dun sa, yung alam mo yung mga detalye, di ba? Even some answers to some questions. Siguro tawag. Dun ako natuturete sa kanya. Iba talaga, iba talaga yung ano niya sa pageant. Siguro kasi dito, I think, What's important for me kasi doon sa una, sa isang budget, yung national costume, pangalawa sa lahat. Talaga? Sa, doon ka na po fascinated? Sa costume. Kasi tawag dito parang, sabi ko nga, uh, I mean, I was born abroad. So, oh. from from a Middle Eastern Muslim country. Oo. Oh. Kada group here. So, parang nasa isip ko, siguro someday soon I'll be able to see these costumes again in person. So, yun muna talaga, doon nagsimula sa costume. I think very visual kasi, very visual kasi ako. And then, at saka ang costumes naman, very visual. Yes. Yeah. Visual din. And then it helped me actually, yung mga parade of nations ng mga oh, candidates. Okay. Yung, sa mga, sa, sa social sa social studies, sa aralang panlipunan. Like mm-hmm. for example, uh, uh, Land of the Mor- uh, Rising Sun. Ah, so doon. Yes. Eh, oh, oh, so ah, okay. Na-incorporate mo siya sa school, sa studies. Yes. So, I'm very, uh, to be honest, I'm a very nerd type or geeky type of person. Oh, oh. So, Siguro yun po yung nag-spring out kung bakit ano, may connection. In a way na parang, I have to learn something. What's, the, oh, what's this all about? What is this country all about? Plus, di ba pumapa, pag may mga pumapasok na parties, nagbibigay sila ng uh, brief introduction oh, of what the country is all about. Correct. So I think, that's also what fascinates me. Ah, ganun pala doon sa country na yun. Ah, okay. So yun. So yung, yung, yung experience mo sa pagpapanood ng mga yun, in-incorporate mo sa knowledge mo. Knowledge. About certain countries. Yes. Or actually, about countries in yes, general, general. di ba? Pero Alec, before we go to yung talagang may budget, na mamaya tayo mag-usap, na ano ka rin no, sa, sa mga pag-supermodel, na aliw ka, di ba? Yes. Kasi nag-a-assist pa nga pa siya sa akin, nag-a-assist pa siya. Kaya, pwede po ba ako mag-assist dun sa supermodel? So, kinukuha ko talaga siya sa supermodel. Yes. Kasi talagang gusto niya eh. Bakit na-fascinate ka doon sa ganong klase? Oh. Ito naman kasi, uh, I think the, it was high school. Uh-oh. So, some of my uh, priority members, priority, meaning to say, 
uh, brotherhood or uh-huh. fr- brotherhood ng mga bex, so fraternity, so uh-huh. it's a mixture of fraternity and sorority. sorority. Pero it's not really the fraternity, fraternity or sorority we know of. It's like barkada, yon, uh-huh. para common term, it's barkada. And then uh, some of them would would always say na, oh, have you seen yung ano, si, si Nalinda Evangelista, ganyan, mm-hmm. or si ano. And then, and then, RPN9, before, mm-hmm. showcase yung mga, ano, through Silver Star Sports, RPN9 and IBC 13, if I'm not mistaken, mm-hmm. pinapalabas din nila yung uh, foreign supermodel, wow. and then, ay, ang galing, and then, syempre, countries pa rin yun, so, parang, oh, okay, Oh, ganito pala ang itsura ng mga tao dito sa country na to. Pero di ba nagpasok ka ng isang winner ng Supermodel? Oh, yes, yes. Ano? Sina ito? Sabihin mo. Si Michelle Panimandor. Panimandor. Kasi taga Lasal din. Yes. Ba? Actually, CSB si siya. Si ah, CSB. Yes. Pero ikaw Lasal Ming ka, di ba? Lasal Ming. Oh. And then I had also of course si CSB. Ah, yun. So, yun. So, we got to meet each other sa CSB through my friend, si VJ Floresta. Oh, of course. The VJ yeah. Floresta. So, Uh, kinausap namin, why don't you try to join? There's no harm in trying, kasi nga naman tawag dito, kapag uh, sumali ka, it's for the experience. Yun lang naman. Oh, nahikayat mo na siya. Okay, kasi tawag dito para she wants to be a mother. Sorry. So, para, Pero na, but, yung isa ganun, naano mo na siya. Na, ano mo oh, na, kasi na, she, was doing, oh, oh. she was doing school modeling stuff. Which is yes, so school lang. Yeah, so school lang. So parang, siguro she wants to enter a uh, bigger, ano, bigger sphere of modeling. Oh, oh. So, yun. Sinali And, mo siya. Sinali ko siya. No expectations nga eh. No expectations yan. Sabi ko, sige. Uh, nung pumasok siya sa top 3, okay, okay na to. And then, kasi uh, all the while, I always knew na si, tawag dito, baka, kasi baka, baka mm-hmm. kasi si Ann Casas noon, oh. yung designer ngayon. Ah, magka-batch ba sila? Yes. Oh. Kasi siya yung pinakabata, siya oh. yung pinaka more exotic. Baka siya yung manalo. Oh. Para di siya yung si Michelle, yung the nano. Uh-huh. And it was really a shock. Not because, not because parang hindi ako naniniwala sa kanya, but because may kakompetisyon uh, siya. Na may nakita ka. Oo. Oh, uh-huh. ba- baka itong maano. Pero Alec, one thing, no? Uh, I will tell you. Yes, diniscover mo si Michelle. Pero, so, alam mo ba, hanggang ngayon nagmamodel pa rin si Michelle? Of course. Nakadiscover uh-huh. ka ng naglast sa industry. Correct. Diba? Actually, tawag dito, dito. Uh, prior to Michelle, there's also this other girl mm-hmm. uh, who, who I discovered actually sa school. Mm-hmm. Sino uh, ito? It was, it was sad na ano, tawag dito. She didn't, uh, she didn't last long in the industry because she already passed away. Sino ito? Christine Bayer. Ay, oo, oh, oh, naku, my love. Oh, just, yes. Oh, oh, oh. Ang pine, sabi nga nila, si Christine Bayer was the Penelope Cruz ng Pilipinas. Oo, oh, oo, oh, 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 napakaganda po no. At saka napakabae. Yes. So apparently, tawag dito, isa rin yun sa mga ano. So oh, again, all oh, for the experience, oh, oh. the bigger sphere. Actually, yun nga lang, tawag dito, it was just sad na hindi na siya nagtutuloy ngayon because wala na siya. Oh, she passed away. One of my love models yan, si Christine. Yes. Uh, Alec, mm. oh, balik tayo sa pageant scene. Yes. Diba? Kasi talagang immerse na immerse. Actually, busy po ito sa trabaho. At saka syempre, hindi na rin siya bagets. Like, he's into ano, physical before, sports, no? Yes. Nagpa-volleyball po siya. Um, kaya nagulat ako before we before we started this interview, updated pa rin siya, di ba? Yes. Hindi talaga mawawala, no, Alec? Of course. Uh, once it's in your DNA kasi, mm-hmm. ando na siya eh. Hindi na maaalis sa'yo. It's part of your uh, cycle. It's part of your routine. Mm-hmm. Plus the fact, syempre tawag dito, immersed din ako sa core ko, mm-hmm. na who's also into, into pageant scene. And then of course, ah, oh, yung mga friends, yes. no? Yes. Oh, oh. And then si VJ. Pupunta so, tayo dyan. Of course. You were, you, you were part of the group na nag, 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 ano, nag trending ng 2010, panahon ni Venus Ra. Yes. Apat po sila. Si Lex, si VJ, si Martin Bautista, at saka si Alec. Yes, po. Okay. Uh, habang ini-interview ko, syempre sinasabi ko yun, but before this interview, meron na akong ginawang introduction na doon yung picture nilang apa. So, so, what, ano ba yun? Sinadyan nyo ba yun, Alec? Manirecord nyo yun? Ano ba yun? Ano may nagsabi, ano may nagsabi, baka it was something planned, it was something, no, it's not. 
Uh, oh, yeah, ikwento mo, ikwento mo. <laughs> it was not actually, it was not. It was something random, it was something out of the blue, it was something na pinagkatuwaan lang. Okay. Kasi, tawag dito, last year, I mean, to, not last year, but 2009, um, we were all having our own personal bets. Mm-hmm. So, tawag dito, everyone was hooked in, yung kay Lex, na favorite niya, which is uh-huh. Venezuela, <laughs> naman naman, hindi pa pumapasok. So, nung last na tinawag, so, Super ecstatic si Lex. Pumasok ko, Venezuela. Pumasok, pumasok. Mm-hmm. Yun, nanalo nga sila, sila nun eh. Diba yun yung back-to-back? Ah, Diana, oh, 2009. Diana. Yes, uh-huh, so yes. 2009. So, ano nangyari nun? So, nagtatatulong si Lex. So, parang, si, basic din siguro ni VJ na, tara, i-record natin. Yung Sino nag-record nun? Si VJ. Ta- Saan? Sa anong ano? Yung sa laptop. Yung sa laptop. Uso pa ba yun nung ano? Uso, uso na ba yung cellphone na pwede? No, ito sa laptop. Ito sa, ito sa laptop. Ito sa Mac. Yun. So, iklaro mo lang. Sinagyan so, nyo ba yun o hindi? Hindi. Ito sa Mac. At saka, I'm sure yung reaction nyo was very spontaneous. It was very spontaneous. Oh. It was something natural. Pero kasi tawag dito dito, ang nangyari kasi nun, iyan o, nilagay nila yung laptop sa sa may TV. TV. Oh, oh. Tapos, Wag na. Yung, ano yung wag na? Sige, wag na lang natin yung record. Oh, ah, ako yung okay. typical, typical. So, typical. Sige, wag na lang natin yung record kasi ano, wala naman mangyayari. Wala naman ano. Siguro. Tsaka, personal naman natin. Ano naman natin yung reaction natin sa isang isa. Okay. So, but the long story short, we were on glossal sa TV. Nakalimutan nyo na nakakon. So, imagine nyo, no? Dito. So, parang imagine nyo dito. Tawag dito, umaanda rin yung buong video na yun. Oo, oo, oo. Naka-record kami. Nakalimutan namin. Sino so, nag-upload? Ito na. Magaling ko there. Ito. ito na. Narealize namin, bandang pa-swimsuit part na. Bandang pa-swimsuit part. Ay, nakalimutan natin yung ano, patayin. Oo. Oh, oh. okay. so, so, syempre nung una, so, syempre nung una, sabi was, ano, tawag dito, ipad natin. Kaya nga tawag dito, natatawa ako, kasi I saw myself, sorry for the third thing, my nose, na, sabi ko, oh shit, nati- sorry for the third thing. Oh shoot, oh shoot, makita yung ano, yung ano. Kaya sabi ko, sa bagay, sa, sa video lang naman ni Lex, kasi account ni Lex yun. So i-upload lang. Kaya yung laptop yun. Kay Ma- if I'm not mistaken, kay Marjay. Kay Marjay, kay Marjay. So sabi, so nak na napusok kami, sabi, parang, sige, dun na lang kay Lex, kasi private account naman. Private account naman, um, wala naman mag-aano doon, kumbaga wala naman Manunod, wala naman masyado mag-trigger. So, as I said... Pinig up pati ng press. Exactly. Oo. Oh, oh. Matatawa ako kasi, nung, nung ni, ni Lod, wala, wala pa, wala pa nangyayari. Wala pa, kumbaga parang wala pa. So, after that, I went to school, MA, Masters. Oo, oh, 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 oh. Maano to eh, masipag to. <laughs> masters ako. Natatawa ako, biglang, Mamaya-maya, oh, uy, nakita ko yung video. Kasi yun. kinahapunan ka agad, di, di ba? Lumabas ka agad. Di Kasi ba? yung pala, uh, the power of social media, twin, twin, yung twin, oh, na, twin, Twitter, na, uh, twin, 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 oh, ito yung ano, ganyan yan. So, biglang pasa, pasa, pasa. The, the next thing I know, morning came, morning came, ito na, my sister was studying in abroad. We have to use camera my, para makikita. Ayan, my sister was studying abroad, ano, tawag dito, na sabi na sa huwing video mo kumakalan. And then, <laughs> sabi ko, what video? Baka kamukha ko lang. What video? Ay, hindi ka pa aware. Hindi pa, hindi pa nagsisink in sa akin oh, na oh. kumakalan. Kasi nga, oh, first, ito sa private account. So, oh, parang, oh. paano kakalan? Paano kakalan? kakalan to. Diba? So, yun yung nasa mindset ko eh. So, yung pangalawa, there was a classmate of mine ng college. So, tagal na namin tinag-usap. Uy, iba ka, sikat ka na. Ah. I saw, I saw it like Perez Hilton. Ah, talaga? Oh, yeah. Pinick up din ni Perez? Napick up oh. ni Perez. Yun yung ano. So sabi, nung una ko nakita, ah, talaga? Anong video? Pag tingin, pag send niya sa akin, ay, ito yung ano, paano? Yung parang, what, what happened? How did it happen? Hindi pa nagsisink in. Mm-hmm. Hindi nagsisink in. So, Ako, I usually commute. So, from, oh, from ito, the office. Oh, ito the office. Oo. From the office. So, nagulit na lang ako, bigla, na parang, yung, yung iba, tumitingin. Okay. So, ah, talaga? Tumitingin. MRT? Sa, MRT, ane, bus. Bus. Bus muna. Tinitingnan ka? Tinitingnan muna ako gano'n. <laughs> Tapos siguro, ah, baka kamukha lang, yung mga gano'n. Uh, okay. So, di yun. 
until such time. Mam, may kumatawag na sa akin. Uh, from, from GMA, from ABS. Oh, oh, oh. So, and then, pinatawag ko doon sa office, sa HR. Kasi nga naman, bawal, bawal munang lumabas talaga yung ano. Ano ba, lumabas ako sa media and all. Oh. So, so pinipilipan. Hindi naman. Kaya lang, since friends ni... So, yung mga unang, unang series na kung saan kailangan ako lumabas sa mga TV shows ah, for guests. Oh, oh. Hindi ako makaguest. Hindi ako makaguest. Oh. Kasi, syempre, lalabas ka, employee ka, employee ka from the company. Correct. You, you are... Kahit hindi mo minimension yung company. Kahit hindi mo minimension yung pangalan ng company. Oh. Syempre, you, you are associated daw. daw. Oh, of course. Tama Un- naman. Tama. Until, okay. until such time, Uh, the owner of that company was parang friend ni na ano, ni na DJ and oh. parang they got to go signal, HR got to go signal. So, ang naging coordination lang nila with my boss, no, kasi my boss was parang my first manager. Bawa, I'll, I'll go for yung Chris TV dati. Oh. I'll, I'll go for oh. Chris TV. Susundin so, nyo, papasok siya dito sa sa office, maglalagin ako. Susundin so, niyo siya dito sa office, ibabalik niyo din siya dito sa office. Ah, may mga demands. Nag- Kasi, no, no, no. tawag dito, a point naman ng, I, I get also the point of my boss. Because, anything that happens in between, wala siya dito, pananagutan ko. Bakit kita pinayagan? So, parang, it's a win-win situation. Uh, I enjoyed the moment, I enjoyed the 15 second of him, and I know... Uh, Pero, tanong po, Alex, do you still have that zest uh, to really be so immersed in pageants. Do you still have that passion? Of course. Sa tingin mo, through the years, no? Kasi that was for 13 years ago. After 13 years, i-assess mo yung sarili mo. Meron ka pa rin bang passion for that? I think kasi, Tito, once it's in your DNA, it's in your DNA. Oh. So, andun pa rin. Ang daming pagbabago na gaganap dito sa pageant and it keeps me wondering, ano ang hinahanap ngayon, Trevor? Kasi, through the years, kasi yun yung ano, eh, basis natin. Eh. Sino ang perfect girl for the Miss Universe pageant? Or Miss World pageant? Nakuha na natin yun, eh, Miss Universe. Miss World no, lahat. Pageant, oh, oh. Oh, oh. I think the, that's the main question. Eh. Ngayon, tawag dito, what keeps me engrossed is there new orga- may mga new organizations, may mga new advocacies, may mga new, mm-hmm. new visions involved. That makes me wonder, ano bang hinahanap niya? Yung actually, tatanong ko sa'yo yan. Ano ba ang masasabi mo sa pageants nowadays? Especially so, Alec, ha? Yung mga girls pala gumagasos na ng mga six figures para lang makasali sa pageants. Ano yung, di ba? I'm sure nakita mo yung pagkakaiba ng pageants before yes. sa pageants ngayon. Ano ang masasabi mo sa nangyayari sa pageantry this day? I think for me kasi dito, Uh, when you get involved in something in a competition, uh, you invest not only not only time, you also invest in money. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. May opportunity cost involved. Sorry for tech- technical technical. Uh-huh. So, may opportunity cost involved. And syempre tao dito hindi ma na- yes, magkakaroon ng six digit figures yan. Why? Kasi number one, you have to prepare for for the dress. Mean dati kasi, dati kasi uh may mga designers na inaalam, papahiram. papahiram. Oh. The problem din kasi naman with the girls, minsan, pag pinahiram, nasisira, oh. or at the same time, minsan hindi maganda yung fit, nababash yung design. Oh. So, mas maganda, magpagaw, para maganda. Pagawa na lang, oh. no? para fit sa kanila. Yes. O oh, talaga, you know, you know ang, ang sa panahon kasi nag-iiba talaga lahat. Mm. Diba? Talagang may pagkakaiba. Hindi naman may iwasan yun. This is 2023. Yes. So talagang dapat lang mag-evolve na rin. Siguro, ganun niya, kailangan na rin gumasas sa mga bumae, kailangan nila na magagaling na sponsors para, well, para to help them defray the expenses yes. in joining a pageant. Yes. Alec, ngayong 2023, I mean, I'm interviewing you you in the year 2023. Okay. What is your advice to future candidates of beauty pageants? Ito, ito ano si Tito, um, sumali din naman ako ng pageant before. It's a mis- it's a misrating pageant. Mm-hmm. So, it's Miss Queen Independence. Uh, lagi namin uh, nasa utak ito. And I think, in the, ano, even in the, ano, even in the corporate world, ito lagi ang pinag, lagi ko nasa mindset. Ito yung mantra eh. Kung nagahanda ka, 
may mas naghahanda sa iyo. I think that's one of the things na you always have to put in mind because tawag dito even though you already gave your 100%, there will be someone who will give twice as much effort as you do. Especially sa panahon ngayon, no, very competitive na mga bagets. Yes, diba? yes. I think, ano, in a competition kasi tawag dito, it's not only how you reach the end, but how fast and how wise you will be to get to that end. Yun yung nasa mindset ko. Paano ka pupunta doon ng mas mabilis? Kung kaya mo doon ng... Wa- Uh, kung kaya mo na mas mabilis doon, how? Kasi may ibang ruta ang gagamitin ng ita. Alec, 2023, malapit na ang pa- international pageant season. Matanong lang kita, ha? forecast lang. Forecast? Oo. Oh, kung tayong magkahiyaan dito, di ba? Miss Earth, anong laban ng Pilipino? Oh, Iliana is very good. Magaling si Iliana. Um, I think she's one of those prepared candidates. I think she's She started off in a school pageant. So I think that experience of her to a wider ano, wider flat, uh, wider stage will help her actually. Kailangan lang siyang ano, mas maging ano, determined. Mas maging uh, focused sa mga preparations niya. Miss International Nicole Borromeo. Well, she's given a lot uh, a lot of time to prepare. Uh, she must be able to you know bring home the crown na tawag dito, ang tagal na rin natin hindi nakuha. 2016 yung kay Kai. Oh, kay Kai. So, seven years ago. Seven years ago. So, it's about time again. Yeah, it's about time daw. Miss World, when do din for new? You know, Miss World is such uh, a cre- uh, Miss World is such actually the unpredictable pattern. Mm. You know, I think that's the more appropriate term because I was supposed to say crazy but it's not. Uh. Crazy kasi may, might have a negative connotation, oh, but correct. it's more of an unpredictable pageant. So, we can never tell. You don't know, no? Kung sino talaga yung mananalo. Yes. Eh, no? Pero, one thing is for certain, again, babalik tayo dun sa core na kailangan prepared ka. Kailangan alam mo kung sino kalaban mo, paano kalalaban. Yun yung importante dun eh. And I think, it will all boil down to class. Kasi, kung mapamantayan natin is, is Megan Young, then I think ang pamantayan natin is not only physical na ganda, but class and upbringing. Kasi yon yung nakita ni Julia Moore ni Kay hey, Megan. Megan. Uh, Nikki Dimora, Miss Grand Philippines. You know, I love Nikki. Honestly, I love Nikki. I was singing up for ano, Miss Universe Philippines, pero sabi ko, nung lumabas sa Miss Grand, ah, lalaban stepping tayo. Stone. La- stepping stone. Lalaban tayo. Sa Miss Grand, lalaban tayo. Yun yung uh, sa akin na, lalaban tayo, hindi ko sinasabing mananalo siya because pwedeng, hindi naman natin alam kasi kung ano yung, ano yung nahanap ng mga judges eh. Mm. Pero malakas ang laban niya to get the, gold, uh, the, the golden, golden crown. Ano naman ang comment mo dun sa pagka first runner-up ni Pauline Amelings sa Miss Supra National? Well, For me, tawag dito, a win is still a win. And first runner-up is no joke. Kasi tawag dito... Sa so dami nila. Sa so dami nila. Um, sabi nila, it was about the Q&A. To be honest with you, sabi nga nila, it was all about the Q&A. Huh? But it's not. Oh, But it's uh, not. Because are. primarily, we have to go back to the she core. Was, she had the best. Diba? Sure, diba? diba? Yun ang pamantayan natin eh. Pero if you go back to the core, si Mutiada Tool, was our first Miss Supranational. Oh, yes. And hindi naman ganong ka- fabulous yung ano, niya, Q&A. So, uh-huh. why are we, ano, why are we harping on something na tawag dito, na parang, hindi pala yun ang hindi, hinahanap. Hindi pala yun ang hinahanap. So, ang labanan kasi naman talaga sa Miss Supra is labanan ng ganda. Oh, ganda eh. Labanan no? ng ganda. Oh. And I'm not saying na ano, hindi mag- mas maganda si ano, or ano. It just so happens na iba sa si, si stage siya, no? So, may maganda si winner. si winner. May maganda, may diyosa. No? Ayoko na lang mention yung winner kasi, you know, I'm for pulling it. <laughs> oh, of course. But, to be honest, to be honest with you, sabi ko nga, kung pag iambing natin, it wasn't yet Pauline. Hindi pa. Hindi, hindi it wasn't pa. Pauline's time for Miss Supra. Or, kung it was Pauline's time, it should have been years before. Parang a year before, or ano, kasi nga, tawag dito, 
hindi, hindi siya yung, kumbaga, hindi pa yung, hindi ito yung panahon niya. Kasi, tawag dito, may lumaban na mas Diyosa. Oo, eh. oh, na mas, yun na nalo, di ba? Alec, Michelle D. Miss Universe Philippines. You know, Michelle D. is such a uh, favorite of mine because she's also from the sun. Oh, oh. Uh, I, I read her profile. I read her profile. I read her, you know, advocacies about autism. It's very authentic. Uh, one word of advice. Don't just stick on that. Don't just stick on the pasarela. Don't just stick on the, uh, the clothing that you wear. What is important is how you will be able to have your rapport, your engagement with other people. Because important is that, as I said to Anne, the owner of the universe, you'll be dealing with a lot of people. So interaction is a must, and dapat hindi matabang ang personality natin. Because kapag natatabangan ang pers ang isang tao sa yon, chances are they will lose grip sa yon. During that, the rate mo nga anun chances ni Michelle. First aid. I'll give eight. 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 Pag sinabi, kasi kung ang pamatayan ko si Catriona, of course, oh, Catriona right. is Catriona, it's a ten. Oh, 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 oh. It's an eight. So, de-develop mo lang yung Actually, children. after nung kay Catriona, ang hirap, no, even the winners I miss you after, ang hirap sundaan. Ang hirap sundaan. True. Ang hirap. And let's be honest about it. Di ba? Iba, iba si Catriona. Uh, Different mold yun, eh, no? Different mold. Ba, no? Alam mo, siguro ang dami. Ito, honestly, I'm one of those people who, were, who tried to convince Catriona before. Oh. Uh, little did many people know. I mean, I'm not saying na ano, pero kasi she was a model of, she was a model of VJ before. Ano ba nag model nga sa akin sa Fashion Week? Yes, diba? of course. Sa, oh. sa akin sa Fashion Week. Pero before that, nag-model for parang lookbook ni VJ. Ni VJ. So sabi ko, why not try this, uh, try, try Bini Bini Dali? Kasi Bini Bini Universe. Uh, I don't know, sabi niya, kasi nga nag road shoot siya noon. Okay. Well, did I know na open naman pala si Madam. Ah. Uh, so, okay. So, all ends meet. So, yun. So, yun. So, yun. Uh, nadinig natin yung assessment ng isang pageant aficionado who's really into pageants. Talaga. Ano siya? Immerse na immerse. Kanina ka before this interview, nag-uusap kami. And siguro after this, before kami before kami mag uh, muwi, eh, mag-uusap pa kami sa mga ibang bagay sa pageant. Eh. Kasi na-miss ko yung usapan namin. Oh. Diba? So, Alec, lastly, paano pa ko may isang bata na lumabis sa'yo? Hingi ng tips. Sir Alec, or Kuya Alec, papa- kasi interesado din po ako sa pageant. Eh. Paano po ba ako may immerse na katulad ng immersion mo sa pageant? Eh? What will you tell the, bo- the boy or the girl? If you really like the pageant, you really like the pageant, and you will really find a way to be in love with the pageant. Parang relasyon lang din yan eh. I mean, I'm not in a relationship right now, but... Ako parang naalala ko yung relationship. <laughs> anyway, pero dito, ang masasabi ko lang, you'll find a way. Uh, you'll try to discover... Uh, kung what's and ifs, kung paano yung gagawin. And of course, find your core. The core na same people with your same interest. And I think it's blossoming right now. Tsaka passionate, no? Kailangan ah. passionate ka sa lahat. Kasi alam niyo po ito, lahat ng Vitalia alam niya. Ay, ay, hindi, hindi pa siguro uso yung Google nun, di ba? Pag re-research sa Google. Yes. Inaalam niya talaga. At magbubulat ka. Even yung mga pasagot, tanong ano, nung nung ano casual interview alam niya 'di ba kasi nagbibiruan kami eh 'di ba nga nag-work po siya sa akin na assistant also so pag nagkikwentuhan kami maaaliw ka kasi ang dami niyang alam so even ngayon kinausap ko siya mag interviewin ko siya for this YouTube interviews mamaya ho mag-uusap pa kami hindi ko muna bibitawan kasi nakakaaliw po ang mga kwento nito <laughs> Okay. So, Alec, please say bye-bye to our audience. Bye-bye po. Salamat, ha? Salamat Thank po. you for giving me time. Kasi busy po siya talaga sa karir niya. Busy po talaga ito. Sabi ko, Tito, weekend. Sabi ko, sige, go. Kaya dito kami, nakita po kami. It's a weekend. It's a weekend day today. So, sinamantala ko yan na pwede. Na pwede kami pareho on this day. Kaya, I, I just want him to be part of my YouTube interview. Oh, so, kasi naging part din po ito ng aking buhay bilang director. Maraming maraming salamat po. Maraming salamat po. 
Mami Kate. Sa tawag namin kasi, tawag kasi kami sa Mama Kate. Yun. <laughs> okay, Alec. Bye-bye. Bye, everyone. Bye.